Hello, and welcome to Lifestyle with Latasha. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how I decorate my dining room with fall decor. I'm starting out by showing you some of the things that I'm going to be putting on this tablescape. And the first thing that will be featured is this Norfolk Pine Garland from Kirkland's. This was a raving, raving item last year. And so this year, I was able to get out there early and grab up quite a few of those pieces, which I absolutely love. So I'm sprucing it up for the table to get it ready for the tablescape and the other items that are gonna come. One thing that I really love is this gather sign. I got this from Home Goods a couple of years back, and I'm quite sure you could probably still find it today. Another item that I'm doing is, you know how you can have leaves left from either garland or swags or whatever you have and they sometimes fall off. Instead of getting rid of those items, utilize them. So here I'm placing them in between some of the branches on the garland just to give it a pop of color. I now will be adding in a few picks. If you know anything about garlands, they tend to have a pretty large hook for you to hang on. So what I did was I just had a pick that had a pumpkin on it and I chose to put it on the end just to cover that up so that you don't get to see it. And then I went in with some little picks that I had gotten from Home Hobby Lobby maybe a few years back. Here, I've just got some little balls from little picks that had fallen off over time. I chose to just stick them in there as well. And now what I'm putting in place is some gourds and some pumpkins just to be able to give the table that fall festive look and just showcase how pretty, pretty it will be when you sit down with your family and friends for dinner. Here, I wanted to give you a close-up look of what those picks actually look like. So as you can see, they're just little small pieces um, that are perfect for fitting into spaces that are blank, that you wanna add little pops of color. There's some leaves that I got from Hobby Lobby. I think you could get them for in a bag, and it's probably 50 pieces, and they are maybe $3.99, but they're really effective when you wanna create a look. I've got some acorns that I got from Hobby Lobby last year that were clearanced. So I utilize those whenever I can in just different spaces. And then of course, there's my thankful sign, which I absolutely love. Now here I'm starting to put down the play setting. Typically we have our tablescape set for six, but for the holidays, I go ahead and put my two links in my table just to allow me to be able to have ample space so when guests come over, um, we're not completely all spread out all over the house. Um, here, these are jute placemats that I got from Hobby Lobby many, many years ago. I really love them because they really give you that fall look and they're just really nice and pleasant to look at. My next item is going to be my 12 inch plates. So I want to tell you, don't skip on estate sales and Facebook marketplace and things of that nature. These plates were actually at an estate sale years back, and I'm so glad that I got them. I typically use them solely for the holiday season because when we have guests over for Thanksgiving, Christmas, things of that nature, there's typically a lot of food. And so because there's so much food, people are able to take those plates and go and get the food that they want and they don't have to go back for that second or third setting until much later. So it just allows people to get all the food that they want, to be honest. With these plates here, these are some plates that I got from Hobby Lobby. Aren't they gorgeous? They have such a beautiful pop of color. And so they're just really, really nice. They were $9.99 with 50% off uh, a few a few years back. And Hobby Lobby tends to recirculate their plates when they come through. Of course, we've got to put some candles on the table. Creates an ambiance. And I love that. These are some small ones that I was able to get from Target. They were $5 a piece a few years back. And then here's another item that I got in an estate sale. When I was on the search for amber glasses, these are some that I was able to stumble upon. So I'm really excited about those. They're really pretty and they set the mood. The 
the last thing that I'm gonna be adding to this tablescape is gonna be the napkins. So just to let you know, if you go to World Market, um, you can get a set of napkins for like six and they're typically like $9.99 each set. However, because I go to at home, they actually have the place settings for eight. Unfortunately though, they did not have this color. So I'm gonna have to go back to uh, World Market and get another set of six to utilize to fulfill my table of eight. But in the meantime, what I did was just put some pumpkins on that play setting. And then, of course, I've got some extra napkins that I can utilize. But for this video, I just wanted to keep the color effect the same. What you saw me do just here are, these are some signs that I was able to get from Hobby Lobby. And I really love them. There were ones that said, thankful, blessed, and grateful. And I love putting those at the place setting because it just reminds us of the small things that we need to remember that we are we have surrounding us every day. Here, I'm gonna give you a close up shot of the actual place setting so you get to see all of the components up close. And after that, we're all done. The final touch is always lighting candles to create an amazing ambiance. I hope that you really like this tablescape. Um, I hope that you got some great ideas and some of the items that if I could still find them, if they still have them since I got them a couple years ago, I'll link them below. So here, the final touch is me creating my picks and stems for my floral arrangement that's gonna go on my buffet. And I'm gonna tell you, the colors that I got, I absolutely, ooh, just fell in love with them. The picks are nice and hearty, and they are really, really uh, a pop of color that were perfect for the back wall. So we gotta do a little bit of cleaning just to get everything ready, and then we're gonna bring those picks in, and I'll let you see. So this is a vase that I got from Facebook Marketplace. I absolutely, absolutely love it because it goes with what I uh, have in the room. And then these are the picks in the stems. So these were $5.99 and they were 40% off. Look at the colors and look how thick those leaves are. I love, love, love them. They're such a beautiful color. And I'm gonna be honest, the camera just doesn't do them justice. So here's the full bouquet, isn't it beautiful? And now I'm gonna give you a quick snap of the table being set. I hope that you enjoy it. I hope you got some great ideas and great inspiration. And if there's anything that you like about it, give me a comment in below. I absolutely would love to hear what your thoughts are. And in the meantime, please don't forget, like this video, subscribe to this channel, and hit that notification bell. In the meantime, thank you so much and happy fall, y'all.